For much of his life, this has been Srinivasan Ramachandran's morning ritual. The day must start with his plans. Years and years I've done this every day without fail. We Hindus, we do a ritual. A tulsi, which is holy basil, we pluck a leaf for the prayers. I have a connection, I feel, you know. When I pluck the tulsi leaf, I generally say I'm sorry to the plant. You know, when I'm stressed, I go to my plant and then just sit there and my stress is gone within like 15, 20 minutes. My daughter says I have too many plants and then I spend too much time with the plants. <laughs> his love for plants extends beyond his home. For nearly 40 years, Sri's been studying plant molecular biology. More recently, he's figured out how a single houseplant can help with a menacing problem. June 21st, 2013, the haze was the worst in Singapore's history. The haze reached hazardous levels. It was 401, the PSI reading. We consider it as hazardous to human health. You know, I suffered a lot for breathing. Um, so I was gasping, I was feeling very uncomfortable. So being a plant scientist, I should do something about it. I can make a solution using plants. The solution? To have a forest, indoors. And no, not the virtual kind we see these days, but bringing indoors the negative air ions found in the great outdoors. Thunderstorms and lightning and also waterfalls, ocean shores, forests, all release negative air ions. When you walk in the forest, 500,000 or half a million negative air ions per cubic centimeter is released. And more than anything, negative air ions can combat the PM2.5, which is the particulate matter 2.5. And this PM2.5 is the pollutant in haze conditions. Plants do release negative air ions, but the negative air ion concentration may not be very high. By placing one plant in the room may not be enough to have the health benefits. But the system what we developed, you can do that. You can do that. That system is a plant ionizer. Using short electrical pulses generated by a probe, the device gives the plant a power boost, enhancing its ability to generate negative air ions by up to a million times. We will burn this mosquito coil inside and create PM2.5 environment, which is hazardous. We will show you how fast it can reduce to healthy levels, less than 55. First, a reading with Sri's plant ionizer off. Without the device turning on, even after five minutes, 10 minutes, up to four hours, even if you leave, it doesn't go down. And now, turned on. When you switch on the device, within five minutes, it comes to normal, which is one unit of PM particles. This plant produces normally only 100 to 200 negative air ions per cubic centimeter. But when we tweak with our instrument, it is more than 120 million negative air ions. The amount of negative air ions which is released by the plants can be equivalent to several forests. But how does the PM 2.5 vanishing act happen? Nothing like a party balloon to get the idea across. If you assume this is 2.5, what could be possibly happening is that this is the negative air ion. The PM2.5 is floating in the air freely and then the negative air ions attach themselves to the PM2.5 and then brings it down. They fall on ground or stick to the surfaces like walls and other places. They'll be like a dust and this dust can be wiped out. For Sri, his many years of research have paid off. Sri, hi, very nice to meet very you. Very nice to meet you. The plant ionizer is no longer a prototype. It's now available on the market. And this is the first time Sri's seeing it. I was amazed after coming here to see how the transformation has happened. All the way from what we started as a box 
It's a big box on the Pro, that's it. It has progressed stage by stage in improving every aspect. And finally, now this is what it is. Even the PM reading can do within this part. They have really taken this to the next level. It is like your child growing into an adult. Not, not adult yet, but still a child growing. No, I'm impressed. Dr. Sri, a little gift from us to you. Thank you very much. Only one. I oh, expected yeah. five. <laughs> <laughs> you can get the big one if you can carry it home with you. Oh, no. Next time. Next time. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs>